It all depends on this rock. Each year, the American Quarter Horse Association honors our top horses and athletes from around the world. In 2021, AQHA members supported the American Quarter Horse by participating in the programs of the American Quarter Horse Association, traveling hundreds, even thousands of miles, and spending weeks away from home to achieve their goals. Our members drive our industry. The American Quarter Horse's lasting impact is undeniable. From a child's smile after a first ride, all the way to competing at AQHA World Championship shows. Thank you for your continued involvement and for the many hours you spend with the breed we all love. We congratulate the 2021 Amateur Division winners. The Amateur Year End High Points received a custom buckle and specially designed AQHA trophy. In the event of a tie, each award winner received an AQHA trophy and the ties were broken to determine the winner of the custom buckle. Congratulations to the 2021 AQHA All-Around Amateur Alexa Ireland Maxwell and Best Cowboy Around, who received a specially designed AQHA trophy and custom hat from Shorty's Cowboy Hattery. Alexa and Best Cowboy Around were also the year-end high points in amateur showmanship. Congrats to this dynamic team. Lena Banks and Strawberry Wine took home the title of 2021 All-Around Select Amateur and a specially designed AQHA trophy. Lena and Strawberry Wine also won the year-end high points titles in amateur western riding and amateur horsemanship. Lena Banks also received the amateur trail high point title with Eye on the Ball. Congratulations, Lena and Eye on the Ball. The 2021 Amateur Halter Stallion and Performance Halter Stallion High Point recipients are Philip Ruse and Rojo Solo Cup. Next up, the 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Halter Mares, Wyatt Haltery and Designed by Christine. Congratulations to the Amateur Halter Gelding High Point, Millie Quarter and I'm a Perfect Bet. The 2021 High Point recipients in Amateur Performance Halter Mares are Roxanne Dugan and Snapchat Diva. Next, the High Point recipients in Amateur Performance Halter Geldings are Jonna Letchworth and On The Rocks. Congratulations to the Amateur Versatility Ranch Horse High Point winner, L. Taylor Brown, and SHR Royal Cadillac, who also earned the Fort Worth Stock Show Award for this title. The 2021 High Point recipients for Limited Amateur Versatility Ranch Horse and the Fort Worth Stock Show Award are Bruce Rice and Sweet Lil Oak. The 2021 High Point recipients for Rookie Amateur Versatility Ranch Horse are Cody Butler and Cruisin' at Sunrise. Congratulations to the Amateur Cutting High Point winners Gianna Hansen and Calculated Risk. The pair also took home the National Cutting Horse Association Award. The 2021 Amateur Working Cow Horse High Point recipients are Garrel Riley and Sparks on the Fence. Garrel and Sparks on the Fence also received the National Reined Cow Horse Association Award. Congratulations to the High Point recipients for Amateur Boxing, Lexi Castanis and Truck and Chicks Rule. The pair also took home a National Reined Cow Horse Association Award for this title. Flavio Ribeiro and Bodega Blitz in 58 are the 2021 Amateur Tie-Down High Point recipients. The 2021 Amateur Breakaway title goes to Jennifer Legg and R.S. Gotcha Maca. Congratulations to this duo. The 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Heading are Philip Tierney and Probably All That. Congratulations to the Amateur Healing High Point Chad Turner and Racine's Metallic. For the second year in a row, congratulations to Sherry Stamper and Bugs Dunnett, the 2021 Amateur Barrel Racing High Point winners. 
Congratulations, Sherry and Bugs Dunnett. Next up, the high point recipients for amateur pole bending are Sarah Fackler and How About a Redneck. Michael Thomas received the 2021 Amateur Stake Race High Point with KY Moneymaker Martini. The 2021 High Point recipients for amateur ranch riding are Karen Johnson and Spot on My Jersey. The 2021 High Point recipients for amateur ranch trail are S. Lynn Walker and Gunner Got Out. Congratulations to the 2021 High Point recipients for amateur reining, Dana Avila and Magnificent Dreamer. The 2021 High Point recipients in amateur hunt seat equitation are Sarah Lebsock and Version of Good Bar. The 2021 High Point recipients in amateur hunter under saddle are Hillary Hoffman and He's Blazing Brave. The 2021 High Point recipients in amateur working hunter under saddle are Leah Roll and I'll Do What You Love. We had a tie this year for the 2021 High Point title in amateur jumping. Congratulations to Marissa French and Miss Blue Gun, and congrats to Kayla Seaman and OMG. Morgan Rakowski and Better by the Minute are the 2021 High Point winners in amateur working hunter, amateur equitation over fences in amateur hunter hack. Congratulations to the amateur Western Pleasure High Point winners, Kenneth Banks and a general consensus. Congratulations to Terry Brewer Booth in Dancing in the Dirt for earning the Amateur Pleasure Driving High Point title. The 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Cowboy Mounted Shooting are Ronald Amos and R.H. Apache Napoleon. Congratulations to the 2021 High Point recipients for the Amateur Limited Cowboy Mounted Shooting title, Kyle Kiss and Holy He's a Smart Pepto. Next up, the 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Dressage Training Level are Adelaide Pickett and WTR Here's to Your Honor. Congratulations to Kristen Patton and Smoke and Custom Chrome, the High Point recipients in Amateur Dressage First Level Dressage and Western Dressage Level 2. The 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Dressage Second Level are Susan Smith and PF Classically Regal. The 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Dressage 4th Level and Amateur Dressage FEI Pre-St. George's are Ashley Noble and Gimme Samoa Cookies. The 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Western Dressage Basic Level are Donica O'Neill and Praise the Blues. Congratulations to the 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Western Dressage Level 1, Kay Cohen and Von Reminix Athena. The 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Western Dressage Level 3 are Andrea Browning and Doc's Classic Prince. Congratulations to the 2021 High Point recipients for Amateur Western Dressage Level 4, Marguerite Durr Gentry and Never Better Magic. Our next year-end award winners are the Justin AQHA Amateur Level 2 Exhibitors of the Year. Thanks to Justin Boots for sponsoring these awards. New styles join our time-tested Justin Bent Rail collection. Like the rugged men and women who wear them, these boots stand for quality, integrity, tradition, and hard work. Straight from our legendary El Paso factory, our expert bootmakers build these boots with features that would make even the earliest cowboys proud. Outfit yourself today with a Bent Rail collection by Justin. The Justin AQHA Level 2 Exhibitors of the Year received a specially designed buckle, Justin Boots certificate, and a $2,000 cash prize. Congratulations to Delaney Baker and My Vintage Mercedes, the Justin AQHA Level 2 Exhibitor of the Year, 30 and under winners. Next, the Justin AQHA Level 2 Amateur of the Year, 31 to 49, is Heather Gallagher and Love Matters Most. Congrats Rebecca Rosa and One Dynamic Crimson, the Justin AQHA Select Amateur Level 2 Exhibitors of the Year. Let's congratulate the 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Division winners. The Equestrians with Disabilities year-end high points received a custom buckle and specially designed AQHA trophy. In the event of a tie, each award winner received an AQHA trophy and the ties were broken to determine the winner of the custom buckle. Congratulations to the 2021 High Point recipient for Equestrians with Disabilities Walk Jog Trail Supported and Walk Jog Horsemanship Supported Awards, Autumn Zundel. 
The 2021 High Point recipient in Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Chalk Canter Hunter Under Saddle is Abigail Smith. Next up, Jonathan Corey Conrad takes home the 2021 High Point title for Equestrians with Disabilities Supported Walk Jog Lope Western Pleasure. Congratulations to the Equestrian with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Lope Trail, Independent Walk Jog Lope Para Reining, and Independent Walk Trot Canter Hunter Under Saddle High Point winner, Amy Bentler. The 2021 High Point recipient for Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Lope Horsemanship and Independent Walk Jog Lope Western Pleasure is Christy Sanderlin. Congratulations to Kelsey Ann Wick, the Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Trail High Point recipient. The 2021 High Point recipient in Equestrians with Disabilities Advanced Showmanship is Robert Castellito. Next up, we have the High Point and Independent Walk Jog Equestrians with Disabilities Horsemanship. Congratulations to Nathan Robble Klein. Congratulations to the High Point and Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Western Pleasure and Independent Walk Trot Hunt Seek Equitation, Leah Glazer. Congratulations to Rebecca Raquel, the Independent Walk Trot Canter Hunt Seat Equitation High Point recipient. Congratulations to the 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Trot Hunt Seat Equitation, Independent Showmanship, and Independent Walk Trot Hunter Under Saddle High Point, Mia Rose Perlmutter. The 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Showmanship High Point winner is Levi Danforth. Next is the Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Para Reining High Point winner, Mason Egan. Congratulations to the 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Lope Trail, Independent Walk Jog Lope Horsemanship, and Independent Walk Jog Lope Para Reining High Point winner, Raina Nicole Taylor. Next, let's move on to the Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse Titles. The owners of these horses received a specially designed AQHA trophy. Congrats to the 2021 Equestrians with Disability Horse High Point and Independent Walk Jog Para Reining Megas Playboy, owned by Stable Strides Farm, Inc. The 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Walk Jog Trail Supported Horse High Point was Delighted Version, owned by Hannah Stanley. The 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Horse High Points and Independent Walk Jog Lope Para Reining Independent Walk Jog Lope Trail, Independent Walk Jog Lope Horsemanship, and Independent Walk Trot Canter Hunt Seat Equitation goes to Make Me Feel Good, owned by Stable Strides Farm, Inc. Next up, the 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Horse High Point and Independent Walk Trot Canter Hunter Under Saddle goes to One Hot Amigo, owned by Stable Strides Farm, Inc. Congratulations to the Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse and Supported Walk Trot Hunt Seat Equitation and Independent Walk Jog Western Pleasure, KM Go to the Bar, owned by Bright Star Stables. Our next Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse title goes to the Supported Walk Jog Horsemanship High Point, Shines Like New, owned by Autumn Zundell. Congratulations to our Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse and the Independent Walk Trot Hunter Under Saddle, Independent Walk Trot Hunt Seat Equitation, and tied for the Showmanship High Point title, That Good Huh, owned by Mariah Minton. That Good Huh tied was Straight Impulsive, owned by Levi Danforth for the Equestrians with Disabilities Showmanship High Point title. Our next Equestrians with Disabilities High Point horse title goes to I'm Colin Dibbs, owned by Corbett Michael Welsh Ryan, in Equestrians with Disabilities Independent Walk Jog Trail. Congratulations to our next Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse title in Advanced Showmanship, Empty Irons, owned by Robert Castellito. The Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse title in Independent Walk Jog Horsemanship goes to Chipped in Gold, owned by Bright Star Stables. Our next High Point in Equestrians with Disabilities Supported Walk Jog Western Pleasure goes to Lazy's Leading Lady, owned by Lucinda Conrad. Congratulations to the Equestrians with Disabilities High Point winner in Independent Walk Jog Lope Horsemanship and Independent Walk Jog Lope Western Pleasure, Hunting for Me, owned by Alyssa Turner. Our final Equestrians with Disabilities High Point Horse title for Independent Walk Jog Lope Para Reining, Independent Walk Jog Lope Trail, and Independent Walk Trot Canter Hunter Under Saddle goes to Setting the Stage, owned by Stable Strides Farm, Inc.
Congratulations to the 2021 Equestrians with Disabilities Year in Winners. Let's congratulate the 2021 Open Division winners. The Open Year End High Points received a custom buckle and specially designed AQHA trophy. In the event of a tie, each award winner received an AQHA trophy and the ties were broken to determine the winner of the custom buckle. Let's kick off the Open Division with the 2021 AQHA All-Around Senior Horse, He's Blazing Trouble, owned by Bonnie Sheeran. The All-Around Senior Horse received $5,000 courtesy of AQHA and a custom shorties cowboy hattery hat. Congratulations, Bonnie, and He's Blazing Trouble. Next up is the AQHA All-Around Junior Horse, Strutton to the Blues, owned by Roger Call. The All-Around Junior Horse also received $5,000 courtesy of AQHA and custom hat from Shorty's Cowboy Hattery. Congrats, Roger and Strutton to the Blues. Congratulations to the 2021 AQHA Open Leading Exhibitor, Anthony Montez. Congratulations, Anthony. The 2021 High Point Open Halter Stallion is Rojo Solo Cup, owned by Philip Ruse. Next up, the 2021 High Point recipient for Open Halter Mares is designed by Christine, owned by Wyatt Holtry. The 2021 High Point title in Open Halter Geldings goes to I'm a Perfect Bet, owned by Millie Corder. HVQ Bill Cody, owned by Brent Johnson, took home the 2021 Open Performance Halter Stallion High Point title. Congratulations! Snapchat Diva, owned by Roxanne Dugan, also claimed the 2021 Open Performance Halter Mare High Point title. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Performance Halter Gelding High Point winner, the Crimson Investor, who is owned by Chris Hammett. The 2021 Open Versatility Ranch Horse High Point title goes to Dunn Wizard 2, owned by John McGinnis. They also received the Fort Worth Stock Show title for this award. The 2021 Open Versatility Ranch Horse Cowboy All-Around High Point Award goes to Diamonds at Sunrise, owned by Brian Lee. They also received the Fort Worth Stock Show title for this award. The Rock, owned by Rusty Rich, is the repeat winner of the Open Cutting High Point and National Cutting Horse Association titles for 2021. Next up, the Open Working Cow Horse High Point is Reverend Jackson, owned by Tracy Pizzini. The pair also earned the National Reined Cow Horse Association Award. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Tie-Down High Point Sly Spender, owned by Logan D. Harkey. KR Resolution, owned by Lyle Grantham, is the 2021 High Point in Open Heading and in Open Healing. Congrats, Lyle, and KR Resolution. The 2021 Open Barrel Racing High Point is Bugs Done It, owned by Stampede Ranches. Next up, the High Point recipient in open pole bending is Sizzlin' Redneck, owned by Kathy Jo Ball. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Reigning High Point Gonna Go Big, owned by El Turio Arquizzi. The team also received the National Reigning Horse Association Award. Congrats to the 2021 Open Western Riding High Point Strawberry Wine, owned by Lena Banks. The 2021 High Point recipient for Open Trail is Eye on the Ball, owned by Kenneth and Lena Banks. The 2021 High Point recipient in Open Western Pleasure is No Doubting Me, owned by Cynthia Kaufman. Amy Lee Ledke owns the 2021 Open Ranch Riding High Point recipient, Who's Chocolate Wiz. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Ranch Trail High Point winner, A Busy Affair, owned by Stephen Kathy Headley. There was a tie for the 2021 Open Ranch Sorting High Point title. Congratulations to Spook's Little Pistol, owned by Donna Cummyford, and congrats to Sun's Power Puff, owned by Dana Campbell. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Cowboy Mounted Shooting High Point winner, Frosty Catted, owned by Amy Shemp. The Open Pleasure Driving High Point title goes to Orange is the New Bay, owned by Loretta Magnuson. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Hunter Under Saddle High Point winner, Al Fulia, owned and ridden by Haley Hartman. Next up, the High Point and Open Jumping goes to What We Do by Blue, owned by Bianca Pietro Kolonowski. The Open Working Hunter, Open Working Hunter Under Saddle, Open Hunter Hack, and Open Progressive Working Hunter High Point titles goes to Blazing Away My Blues, owned by Jerry Lee Pratt. 
The High Point and Oakland Dressage training level is a lot of hope, owned by Shelly Karen Hogg. Elizabeth Stoltz and her American Quarter Horse Hot Summer Nights won the 2021 High Point title in Open Dressage first level. Next up, the High Point and Open Dressage second level, Open Western Dressage level two, and Western Dressage level three is WTR, here's to your honor, and Noel Anderson. Downtown Cool, owned by Diane Adams Simmons, won the 2021 High Point title in Open Dressage third level. Diane and Downtown Cool also tied for the 2021 Open Dressage 4th level title. Congratulations also to I Can Can I, owned by Stacy Westfall, for the Open Dressage 4th level title. Katherine Abrams, American Quarter Horse, Zans Blue Frost won the 2021 High Point title in Open Dressage FEI Intermediate 2. There was also a tie for the 2021 High Point title in Open Western Dressage Basic Level. Congratulations to Well Bred and Red, owned by Melanie Chaparro, and congrats to Star Leaguer Strider, owned by Kenny Williams. Tim Christensen and his American Quarter Horse, My Dream Horse, won the 2021 High Point title in Open Western Dressage Level 1. Congratulations to the 2021 Open Western Dressage Level 4 High Point winner, Jagalicious, owned by Rachel Ori. Before we move on to the top professionals in our industry, AQHA would like to take a moment to recognize the association's 30 and 40 year judges. American Quarter Horse judges are held to the highest quality of standards, and we are thankful to their dedication to AQHA. all of the AQHA approved judges for all of your hard work and service through the years. Each year AQHA recognizes the top professionals in our industry. Each AQHA affiliate has the opportunity to nominate an AQHA professional horseman as affiliate most valuable professional. The AQHA professional horseman then select the overall MVP from the list of affiliate MVPs. The 2021 Most Valuable Professional is Susie Jean of Bryan, Texas. Susie has been an active member of the Association of Professional Horsemen since it began in 1994. She has also been an AQHA judge for more than 20 years. She has an infectious smile and actively strives for excellence, pride, and integrity in every aspect of her life. She has woven her life to include her passion for horses and for mentoring her fellow equestrians. She has made an impact on the horse industry in many ways, including forging a path for her fellow women in the industry by being the first female president of the National Snafflebit Association and by receiving the 2004 AQHA Professional Horsewoman of the Year Award. 
As an industry leader, Susie Jean sets an example for young adults in the industry. She is dedicated to her students as an equestrian coach at Texas A&M University and is known to be an encouraging and positive influence on those around her. She also volunteers her time by serving on multiple committees and boards, such as the Texas Quarter Horse Association Board of Directors, the AQHA Show Committee, and American Quarter Horse Youth World Cup Committee. Let's hear a few words from Susie Jean about receiving this award. Howdy y'all, I'm Susie Jean, AQHA's 2022 recipient of their Most Valuable Professional Award. And this is my most valuable assistant, Kisses and Scotch. I have to tell you that in our search for greener pastures, neither one of us realized we'd wind up at Texas A&M on their championship equestrian team. After stepping out of the show arena, we've been rejuvenated here in Aggieland by many incredible young women as they prepare to step boldly into the arena of life. We pride ourselves here in developing strong leaders who are committed to respecting our horse and handing down the principles of loyalty, integrity, and excellence to generations of horsewomen to come. I am truly humbled to be recognized by my peers in this, the most important turn I've taken on AQHA's road to the horse. My congrats to my dear friends, Jerry Erickson and Michelle Tidwell on their accomplishments and awards for their many years of selfless service. The three of us have truly grown, lived, laughed, loved and cried together and are forever grateful to our AQHA family and Wrangler for encouraging us to follow our dreams. Again, heartfelt thanks and may God bless you and yours. Congratulations, Susie Jean. Being named a Neutrina AQHA Professional Horseman and Horsewoman of the Year are top awards of the equine industry. These individuals are nominated and voted on by their peers each year. Neutrina supports AQHA Professional Horsemen by sponsoring the Ride the Pattern Clinics at AQHA World Championship events. During the clinics, donations are accepted for the Professional Horseman Endowment Fund, which Neutrina matches. To date, Neutrina has donated more than $55,000. Safe is essential, but it also gives you the freedom to do the things you love. Make safe exciting with Safe Choice. Before we announce our 2021 winners, let's highlight all of the professional horsemen and horsewomen who have shared their knowledge, talent, and skills with us throughout the years.
Wow, what an amazing group of individuals who have made an impact on our industry. Now, let's recognize the 2021 Neutrina AQHA Professional Horsewoman of the Year and Neutrina Don Burt AQHA Professional Horseman. The 2021 Neutrina AQHA Professional Horsewoman of the Year is Michelle Tidwell of Madisonville, Texas. Michelle is a longtime AQHA member and has shown her commitment to the industry by serving on the AQHA Professional Horseman's Council and AQHA Show Committee. Additionally, she has been a Neutrina Ride the Pattern clinician and a supporter of the AQHA Professional Horseman's Endowment Fund. Michelle has also devoted herself to teaching the youth of the industry. She has been involved with organizing the American Quarter Horse Youth World Cup and has served as a team coach for the past decade. She has been a trainer and a coach for more than 20 years. Her clients range from four years of age to over 70. Her passion is to ignite the heart of any rider from beginner to professional. Michelle can be defined as having the true heart of a cowgirl. She was first recipient of the Car McQuishan True Grit Award, which is given to an AQHA professional horseman who goes above and beyond. She is known for being someone who works in the background without a desire for recognition. Her passion and true grit are contagious in the horse industry and evident by the countless riders she has helped mentor along the way. Let's hear a few words from Michelle about being named the Neutrina AQHA Professional Horsewoman of the Year. I am so humbled to be named the 2021 AQHA Neutrina Professional Horsewoman of the Year. This award means so much to me and I can't even begin to express in words what it means. The people before me that have been named Professional Horseman and Horsewoman of the Year, many I'm great friends with, they're mentors to me, they've paved a pathway for us. To, to follow and lead, and, and it means so much to be on the same list as all of them. To be voted on by my peers is very special, and I can't tell you all how much I do appreciate this and all of your support on it. I've enjoyed serving on Professional Horsemen Council. I enjoy helping with the Ride the Patterns. I enjoy everything I do with AQHA, and being named this makes it even more special now on all that. Um, the people before me that were named this, like again, I've said it, a very special friendships with them. Diane Eppers, you have no idea what you've done for me. Leslie Lang, you've been a great mentor. So many of them, I know that there's so many more that I, I'm not going to name them all, but one very special one is Nancy Cahill, who won this award 25 years before me, so it makes it so special. I can't tell you all how much that is really special to me. Also, to be nominated along with Darlene and Cindy, you guys, y'all are so great, and I was so honored to be on the same ballot with you. You are both very special, and I appreciate everything you do for AQHA. Winning this also along with my good friends, Jerry Erickson and Susie Jean, just even tops it off. So I can't tell you all again, thank you. Thanks to all the AQHA professional horsemen, and keep up the good work, thank you. Congrats, Michelle Tidwell. The 2021 Neutrina Don Burt AQHA Professional Horseman of the Year is Jerry Erickson of Whitesboro, Texas. Jerry has committed his entire life to the horse industry. He is a longtime trainer and breeder who specializes in English classes. He is an AQHA approved judge and has served on multiple committees and councils, including the show and amateur committees and the AQHA Professional Horseman's Council. He was also a member of the group that was instrumental in making Working Hunter Under Saddle an AQHA recognized class. Jerry is a knowledgeable horseman who has been a respected industry leader for decades. He truly loves to teach anyone willing to learn and has dedicated his time to improve the industry. He has served as a clinician at many AQHA judges workshops and acted as a mentor to a multitude of judge applicants as they prepare to test for over fence classes. He also served as a Neutrina Ride the Pattern Clinician numerous times at AQHA's championship events. When he is not devoting his time to training, judging, committees, or teaching, his focus can be found in his breeding program. Jerry has invested more than 30 years into raising top quality American quarter horses, and his program has produced four AQHA World Champions and five Reserve World Champions, among many other AQHA achievements. Now, let's hear from our 2021 Neutrina Don Burt AQHA Professional Horseman of the Year. 40 years ago, I purchased an AQHA Life membership. Little did I know at that time that the quarter horse would become my life. Over the decades, there have been several low points to my career. 
However, these difficult times have been way, way overshadowed by the great horses, wonderful clients, and a host of friendships. As this award is presented by my peers, fellow professional horsemen and horsewomen, I am truly humbled and thankful. Thank you very, very much. Congrats, Jerry Erickson. Thank you to everyone for tuning in to watch. On behalf of the American Quarter Horse Association, I wish each of our members continued success in the future.